why I fled Nigeria during hashtag end bad governance protest. Shore says, I remember that other a day or two to the protest, Shore left the country to the US and then from the US to the Canada. And he's speaking from there, from Canada since then. He went actually and organized the protest again in Ontario, seeking international attention. Okay. But now that uh, why the protest is going on, government had to start clamping down on everyone that supported or organized the protest. Okay. And on this, the guy left. And why he left, he declared he wanted uh, immigration, declared he wanted, everybody would declare he wanted, saying that as his life was, even time he entered Nigeria, as he's coming in, they are locking him up straight away. So now he has responded now by telling people why he chose to be a to be out of the country during this uh, hashtag and bad governance uh, protest. Nigerian human rights activist Omo Eleshowere has revealed why he was not physically present during the just concluded protest against economic hardship, bad governance, and hunger. The former African National Congress presidential candidate was one of the key organizers of the demonstrations, the case sword report. Hmm. However, many questions why he was not in the in the country to lead the protest, but was prompting or rather promoting the movement via social media. So speaking on Monday in an interview on Nigeria Info FM's morning crossfire, crossfire program monitored by Doc Sol. The activity said um, he did not need to be physically present before making a, a difference. Being part of the protest most times has nothing to do with physical presence. Since the protest started, I participated fully. I just been I have been away from my family for five years. I had other obligations, so that is why I was not on ground. I am not saying those things are more important than the protest. So effective teamwork is what matters. We have organized, we have organizations running this. And in the 2019 protest, I was also not physically present. Circumstances didn't make it possible for me, but I will fully, okay? But I participated fully even if I was in detention. The nature of this demonstration has changed to accommodate technological interventions. It has made it possible for people like me to be dead, to be 10,000 miles away and impact greatly on demonstration like this, um, like this via social media. So when it is convenient for me, I will be on ground again. I have done 200 protests in my life time. I was not physically present for them. I was not physically present for all, but I participated fully. Hmm. Oh, boy. So he also revealed that the protest will resume on October 1 if their demands are not fully addressed. Some of the demands include the return of first subsidy, investment in education through students' grant not loan, crash in food prices and scrapping of 1999 constitution to be replaced with a people term uh, constitution or people driven constitution. On demands are uh, a minimum wage of 25,000 naira monthly, the inc unconditional release of, of uh, Nam De Kano, leader of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB and demilitarized demilitarization of the southeast all of these are in their demand oh boy so now with what we are seeing how we show that the Nubu government is ready to meet all these demand because some are short term why some are also long term so what kind of commitment are we expecting from Tinubu for before we believe that all the um demands will be met. 
has always a well done eh, absentee fighter who leads troops to, to do battle to the battle or uh, who leads troops to the battleground to run and hide. <laughs> uh, some I remember Ojuku of Biafra Army. He ran away after leading the massacre of Igbos in the name of independence. He was pardoned and recoupled all his and father's properties, all his father's properties, I mean, but the unfortunate followers properties in River State was declared abandoned uh, by also uh, one of Igbo land. <laughs> that they run away one of Igbo land. Hey, wow. Today, another came, came, Mazenam the Kano, outside to inside the people. For long, he succeeded, but caught like a rat in a ready, in a nearby country, and he is cooling his feet in DSS. Host, I mean a hotel, or rather hostel. DSS hostel is the prison at Kirikiri. And now, if you worry, another coward inciting the gullible to their, to their worst. Hmm. To their woes. Is it serious? Look out for comments from, uh, okay, all worshippers, they will soon insult the man. This is serious, so... Uh, so I believe the protest was desirable and needed urgently, but thoroughly uh, disappointed that you you helped to put other people and their precious children on arms way while you and your family were tucked away safely 100 miles away. Honestly, you had to, you had no business being one of the protest organizers because we that act act of uh, yours or a way that uh, acts of yours you were deceptive and was no different from the politicians acts of uh, deception hmm. so um sure is now being uh, like uh, blasted now why some say it is good some are saying he should come down and, and lead the protest by himself okay why a lot of uh, other things have gone wrong during the last protest okay they are still trying to uh, tell him he has no reason to run away even if you say the protest will resume august 1 make yourself available to be part of that uh, protest so thank you for listening and let's have your comments.